rising from the Salisbury Plain in England, this colossal ring of stones is perhaps the most iconic prehistoric monument on Earth. This is Stonehenge, built over 5,000 years ago. It represents a feat of engineering and a mystery that continues to challenge everything we know about Neolithic society. The sheer effort required to construct Stonehenge is staggering, defying the simple image we often have of early human civilization. The outer ring is composed of giant sarsen stones, some weighing up to 30 tons. That's the equivalent of five adult elephants. These massive blocks were quarried roughly 20 miles away, a monumental task in itself when all you have are logs, ropes, and raw human power. But the most stunning part of the mystery lies within the inner circle. The inner ring is made of smaller blue stones, but these stones present the greatest puzzle. They weigh up to four tons each, which is still incredibly heavy. And here is the unbelievable part. They were transported an astonishing 140 miles from the Priscelli Hills in Wales, a journey seven times further than the Sarsen source. The question of how prehistoric people moved these rocks across land and water remains one of history, as most hotly debated topics. Can you imagine floating a four-ton rock on a primitive raft, navigating rivers and then dragging it for miles over land? Some recent theories even propose a less labor-intensive idea that ancient glaciers might have done some of the heavy lifting, carrying the stones closer to the site centuries before, where they were simply collected by the builders. It's a compelling thought, but it doesn't diminish the scale of the achievement. But even if we solve the how, the biggest riddle of Stonehenge is why. Why did these ancient tribes invest generations of effort, spanning centuries, to build this? The first major theory holds that Stonehenge was an ancient astronomical observatory. The structure aligns with celestial phenomena with striking accuracy. It's not just a random circle of rocks. Its geometry is precise. On the summer solstice, the longest day of the year, the sun rises directly over the famous heel stone, and on the winter solstice, the shortest day, the sun sets perfectly through the central axis of the great trilith. This incredible alignment strongly suggests it was built as a sophisticated calendar, a way to predict seasons, mark time for harvests, and schedule critical rituals. It was their clock, their calendar, and their guide to the cosmos. But there's another dominant theory, one that points to a more spiritual purpose. This theory posits that Stonehenge was a sacred burial site and a center for healing. Archaeological excavations around the site have uncovered over 50,000 cremated bone fragments belonging to at least 63 different individuals. These weren't just ordinary people. Analysis suggests they were likely high-status elites or powerful community leaders buried in a place of immense importance. This makes Stonehenge one of the largest Neolithic cemeteries in Britain. Furthermore, there's a fascinating idea that the blue stones themselves held special power. Chemical analysis has revealed that some of them have unique acoustic properties. They ring like a bell when struck. This has led some researchers to believe they were considered magical or to have curative properties. Ancient people, perhaps sick or injured, may have made long pilgrimages images to Stonehenge, believing that the stones, or the site itself, could heal them. So, was it a place for the living to track the heavens, or a place for the dead and the desperate? Whether it was a giant calendar, a complex healing center, or a sacred place to worship ancestors, Stonehenge remains a powerful reminder of the incredible knowledge and ambition of our Neolithic ancestors. It's a testament to their ingenuity, their beliefs, and their connection to the world around them. The enigma behind these massive stones continues to defy complete explanation, challenging us to uncover the true secrets of a society lost to time. What do you think its true purpose was? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this journey into the past, don't forget to like and subscribe for more mysteries from history.